Because, I mean, the extra action is cool, but all my stuff is, like, supposed to be zero cost. I want to go buy stuff. I have a lot of gold. Well, flight. You guys are all attacking. I don't like that. Um, Gain eight block, draw a card. Might as well get that going. Draw three cards, because I don't discard anymore. Um, Make me angry. I think I want to just start with like the lowest one. Yeah, I think that's right. Oh, wait, 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 wait. wait. Gain five block, upgrade all cards in your hand. The rest of combat. But I don't discard them. So... I guess they will stay upgraded, is my hope. What do I gotta do? I gotta get 15 block. Yes. Okay. Deal 8 damage out of copy. That's free. Attack him there. But I can just, like, defend. That's not bad, right? Deal 9 damage. Not awful. Do I wanna just defend? I feel like 3 damage isn't horrible. Let me get through that. Okay. Those are all smacking me. I don't know what Flight does. Receives 50% less attack damage. Cancel the dealt attack damage three times in one turn. If I do three damage to him. Okay, I like this one for right now. I do like that guy. <gasps> I need to use so many of my block cards before I can even use any of my... Oh, this might have been bad. I think that these clash cards might have just become useless with that. Yikes. I should have chosen none of them. That's pretty crazy. Um, or I could just keep blocking up and I can't fucking use it. Okay. And I don't want to use that. So I guess I'm just super armored for no reason. Okay. Awesome, they're strengthening themselves. <laughs> I turn right at nothing. Um, oh god. I'm starting to realize that this pyramid thing was a bad idea. Because I can't play any of my big clash cards. Attack, 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 skill. Attack, attack. So I guess I am going to be doing this and this. And I gotta do this. And what is preventing me from doing that? This is a skill. Use that. And I I can use Clash now. Okay. Big attack turn. I'm gonna have to start going after these guys because they're gonna fuck me up. Uh, Clash you. Clash you. Um, anger. I'm angry at you. Oof. Every time you lose HP, this combat deals 18 damage. Seems pretty okay. Oh, if I do enough... Oh, they get, like, grounded and stunned. If I do three attacks on them in a turn. I don't have the ability to do that to this guy. So I guess I might as well just... 18 plus 4. I can kill the back guy. That's probably the best way to go about it, I guess. Rip that guy open. Oh, or she's 50% less attack damage. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> well, that's unfortunate. This pyramid was a really bad idea. I'm going to have to start taking defense cards out of my deck, actually, now I'm thinking about it. Because I don't know if I can get rid of that rune thing. And that guy's going to get stronger. Because, of course, he is. Um, I guess that I want to, oh, what was this? Upgrade all the cards. I like upgrading cards. Upgrading cards makes me happy. Um, and I want to attack a dude. Game deals 24 damage. That seems pretty solid. 
I know it's that'll be a little 12 to that dude and I can ground him yeah we'll do do that I can't ground him because I'm crazy because I already used a mana oh it's all going wrong all going wrong I take so much damage here ow 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 ow, ow, ow. remember when I was uh, talking earlier and I was like man I wonder if uh I didn't choose a difficulty for this. <laughs> well, funny thing about that. All right, so I can just start attacking this dude. Yeah, get rid of that. And I might as well get some cards in my hand. Oh, wow, I got like three cards. There we go. If I could sell this Rooney Pyramid, I'd actually really love that. This is uh, causing me problems right now. But I'm thinking that I probably cannot. Deal 2 damage, 10 damage, draw 2 cards. I don't need more card draw. Deal 3 damage to a random enemy 3 times. Oh, more anger. I like more anger. I'm wondering if there's a way I can sell that relic. I really don't like this relic right now. <gasps> okay, I'll, I'll skip the merchant. Oh my god, I was going to lose it. Oh, more anger, yes. Give me more anger. Whenever you play a power attack and skill in the same turn, remove all your debuffs. Um, I really do want more anger. Discard any number of cards and draw that many. Um, exhaust one card, draw two cards. Intimidate, apply one weak. I think that I'm going to be cycling through cards a lot now. I kind of want to get rid of one of these block cards because they're really going to start holding up my clash cards a lot. That's the issue. Yeah, because they're going to start bogging me down a huge amount. But it's kind of weird. First round, I'm getting all these defense cards. And I get this fucking Verdict Pyramid thing, which is not helping me in any way. Now I got to start getting rid of these damn cards. That was a lot of money just to start trying to sort out the issues that my deck's got right now. Yep. Well, let's go and see what kind of mysteries lie ahead. You find yourself in a room filled with racks of test tubes, beakers, flasks, forceps, pinch clamps, stirring rods, tongs, goggles, funnels, pipettes, cylinders, condensers, and even a rare special tube of glass. Why do you know the name of these tools? Doesn't matter. You take a look around. Let's find some potions. Oh, we got all of these? Fill all your empty potion slots with random potions. That seems cool. Game follower plated armor. Use a card in your discard power and return to your hand. It costs you this turn. I don't know what plated armor is, but I don't think I'm going to use it as much as I'm going to use that. Because liquid memory seems good. Let's go see some more random stuff. Oh! Oh, I guess I'm figuring out what plated armor does. Oh, what does plated armor do? At the end of your turn, gains 14 block, receiving unblocked attack. Damage reduces plated armor by one. Oh, so it like recursively gives it. Okay. Well, I guess I'll use that. You're weakened. Um. Oh. I guess I'm gonna start getting set up. Uh, give me. Give me that. Give me a five block. That'll be enough. Except I'm gonna have to use this anyways, but I wanna use my clash. So attack and then attack. And there we go. Oh, I actually got through a lot of my cards there. That was a good first turn. Just a weakened boy. Except your weakness wears off, which is a little bit sad. Gain eight block, draw one card. Well I gotta gain block anyway, so I might as well do that. Um and I can't clash because I got a skill. So let's see how much shit I draw this in attacks. Oh, none of it. Hell yeah. Um. Oh, well, get angered upon, get angered upon, get clashed upon. And. I should have vulnerable him first. That's, a, that's my bad. 
Six times two is 12. I'll take one damage. There are worse things in the world. I wonder if I vulnerable them if I could have actually killed them. Not sure. The damage isn't too bad. I can heal that up. Is that one over? I actually don't have any of those cards in my hand right now. Oh, that seems pretty sweet. Smashing that dude. Um. Wow, I literally have like. <laughs> I literally have only basic cards except for Bash. Which I, I guess again, Bash is not amazing. I guess the only problem I have is actually blocking cards. If I have a lot of attack cards, it does not affect my other, uh, like my zero cost card. It's just if I have a lot of defense cards. So I guess I kind of want to just strike him. Oh, uh, but I'm going to, uh, if I had one more. Oh, there we go. Dead. There we go. True regret. Gain seven block. Gain da, 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 exhaust. That is actually fine. That's pretty fun. I like this one. This one is going to help me cycle through those extra block cards. Okay, so I got to... Regen heals HP at the end of your turn. Each turn, regen is reduced by one. It seems like good would actually skip... You know what? Can I just drink this now? Apparently not. I'm going to go ahead and discard that and pop that guy in. I think that's a good way to kind of skip having to use a campfire. So I don't really want to be... I think I have to fight one of these elites, regardless of which way I got about it looks at things. Yeah. If I go here, here, and here, I get a campfire. Is this a... No, it's not the boss up there. That's just a chest for sure. I guess I'm going to go this way, yeah. Find yourself in an old decorated chamber. In the center of the room, a large skull sits atop an ornate pedestal. As you approach, the skull bursts into flames and turns to face you. This can be nothing but good. <laughs> what is it you seek? What is it you offer? In sync with those final words, the door behind you slams shut. <laughs> I guess I'm losing 6 HP. Um, I don't need more potions. I don't need a random card that'll fuck up my deck synergy. So let's get some gold, I guess. I have to spend health to leave. I guess I have to leave. <laughs> I don't want to lose all my health. Jesus Christ. Not exactly what I wanted going into an elite room. But I guess that's how it's going to be. I'm going to just use my health regen potion right off the bat, I think. This enemy intends to block and use a buff. I'm going to literally just use this right off the bat. I want to get some life back. I want to gain some block. Uh, give me that. Upgrade my cards. That seems pretty solid. Deal some damage and apply. Oh, deal some damage to all enemies and apply vulnerable. That seems pretty good. Um. Get rid of that guy, get rid of that guy. I don't really know if this is going to summon more of these things. I'm kind of a little bit like, eh. I don't know what this dude does at all. Gremlin leader. It sounds like he might be like a summoner. I bet you that's like summoning or something. Um, I kind of want to keep this in my hand for when I get a lot of defense cards that I don't really know what to do with. I'm gonna go ahead and bash him and then make him make myself angry at him. Because I could clear up my hand here, but I kinda wanna the whole point of this card is to get rid of those extra those extra defense cards. Yeah, okay. I totally called it. Oh they're angry. Oh no. Aggressive. So okay. So he does just like fucking gain one Draw some cards. You can draw a bunch of cards. Is there anything in here that is not? That's a skill and... That's a skill. Okay, so I can use my two there. I'm gonna have to start attacking these dudes, I guess. Is that the play? Do I just attack these dudes? 
I think they get stronger each turn. Mm, I'm going to go for the Gremlin Leader. I should have just been going for Wrath of Bat, I think. But I mean, I wouldn't mind having a bunch of anger cards. Like, the longer this fight goes, I feel like the stronger I get. I'm going to start taking out his weak dudes, I think. This might be the right idea, this might be the wrong idea, I'm not sure. I'm going to get my blocks up, and then I'm going to go ahead and use this guy to clash and start attacking this dude. There we go. Oh yeah, I'm happy with that. Actually, I've gotten a lot of health back. That potion is pretty sweet. And he's strengthening them. Ah, just what I needed. Uh, apply weakness to all enemies. I feel like I might want to save that for next turn, because I think that unless I get one of those flash cards. Ah, oh, that's hard. One, two, three. Yeah, I guess I do have to kind of do that. I don't know, 18 attack is like not nothing. I could just go and start attacking this dude. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. Attack this dude, and if I throw up a block, I don't think I'll take any damage. Yeah, there we go. That'll do. That'll do for right now. Smack. Gotcha. Oh. Oh, there is just more. <laughs> oh, no. Didn't I have a card that was like... Deal damage to everyone. <laughs> Where's that card at? My hand is full. Did not realize there was a hand limit in this game. Great to know now. I guess so this is a good time to use this. Um, what is that gonna do? Apply three vulnerable. That dude's gonna do a lot of damage to me. So I kinda wanna get him out of here. Um, there's some blocking, and then Flash. I'm angry at him. And I could really use a little bit of block, I think. I'm gonna take a lot of damage here if I don't gain a little bit of block. Yeah, I gotta use that. This isn't a lead, I guess, so... This is the time to use it. Nine times three, damn, that dude is fucking... Gonna slam me. I think there is a card in here, though, that does, like, a big AoE attack, which would be awesome for me. See, like, I just lost all that health again this, this fight. Uh, Anger. Grr. Deal six damage. So let's just anger this dude to death. Uh, oh. Didn't realize you just had to kill that guy. Warcry. Draw two cards. Put a card from your hand on top of your draw pile. Deal 7 damage. Shuffle it days into your draw pile. I don't want to fuck up my deck. So I do like these cards that are free. Upon pickup, upgrade 2 random attacks. I like that. Don't like that upgraded perfect strike because I don't really like that card. I was kind of thinking about getting rid of it. Um, I got a lot of health. I kind of want to go upgrade something. I don't really want to go upgrade something. That seems decent. Intimidate, apply two weak. Anger, deal eight damage. The angers are good. But if I can upgrade something so it becomes free, that is also quite good. Or like at least becomes less mana. But I, I think the angers doing damage is kind of important. Battle trance. I got a lot of those. I'm okay with that. Clash or Anger, I think all those are fine. Might as well go with the Clash, yeah. Give me this Clash card. Give me a little upgrade there. Oh. How's this thing doing? On death applies too vulnerable. I don't like that so much. Let me, give me a little bit of block. Give me some more cards. 
Um, let me just like basically one shot this dude, I guess. I am vulnerable now, which I don't like a huge amount. Maybe I should have done that when on the turn heal he was like defending or something. Yeah, because that does hurt a lot. Well, let's get that one out. Um, how many skills do I have? I have a block skill. I'm going to use that. Um, well, that's not super useful. I guess I'm going to do seeing red because I do have to get that out of my, car out of my hand if I'm going to get this clash off. Right, so you have to go and do that and that. Should have started with the bash. I think I did this last time. Um, I did a lot of stuff, but I didn't do enough stuff. I'm still taking damage, and I don't like when I take damage. I did heal. That's rude. Um, anger. Fuck you. Metallicize. Give me that. Let's hope that I don't get too many blocks. Skill or cry. Draw two cards. Wow, I'm getting all my blocks right now. So that's kind of cool. Uh, defend. Draw two cards. There's a card. I don't need another strike. What'd that do? <laughs> and that, uh... Put a card from your hand on top of your draw pile. So the draw happened first. Okay, I just didn't notice it, I guess. And I'm gonna clash him. Jesus Christ, I did a lot of damage. I think I should be okay. 13, yeah, okay. There we go. Back on track. Um, we can you, and I'm just gonna get angry at you. There we go. Add two wounds into your hand, gain 20 block. Gain seven block, exhaust one card at random. I don't really like that. Exhaust all non-attack cards in your hand, gain five block for each. <clears throat> that might be good. <clears throat> Cause then I can kind of just wipe my hand. Which I kind of like that. I'm gonna take that, yeah. Gain five dexterity at the end of your turn, lose five dexterity. I don't know what dexterity does. Mm, I think I seem to always go first. So. Nunchucks. Every time you play 10 attacks, gain. Okay, I can do that. Seems good. Seems to play into my style. I like that. Well, hello there, lizard. This enemy intends to inflict a powerful negative effect on you. I don't like. That it says powerful. That's the first time I've seen powerful appear in this game. I don't know if I like that. So I'm just gonna hit him with a bunch of stuff and hopefully he doesn't apply anything too negative. Perplexing glare. Oh, confusion. Whenever you draw a card, randomize its cost. Oh, that's so bad for me. This will still be zero though. So give me that, and then give me that. And then deal 12 damage apply to weak. Give me that. Okay. Right. Is this like decrease? Oh, 25% less damage for two turns. Okay, I get you. Oh, I'm so confused for so long. Oh, I really don't like this whole confusion thing. Oh, this is really not ideal because it doesn't seem to give me zero cost cards. That's kind of a little bit rough. Gaining five block, I guess. Oh, and I, they don't leave my hand either. Oh, no. It's really bad, actually. Oh, that's still zero. I guess I'll use that. That 
became zero. That's cool. 24 damage is not too bad. I go this is actually just a useless card now. So I might as well toss it. Perfect strike. Um, by perfect strike, do I have anything in here that'll give me any kind of armor? Draw three cards, you cannot draw additional cards this turn. I guess I'll do that. Upgrade all cards in your hand. Okay. There's a little bit of block. Bash. Deal 10 damage, apply vulnerable. Okay. Not too bad. Damn, I really almost fucking slaughtered him. I'm taking one more damage, but I still think that's the worst. I think I should just be able to kill him now. Yeah, I can just kill him. Whoop, oh, there we go. That is a sketchy thing to fight for me. Damn. Lose 2 HP, deal 10 damage. Or 20 damage, Jesus. That seems like a lot of... Uh, I don't know if I would just want to accept that. Deal 9 damage. Put a card from your discard pile on top of your draw pile. I like that, actually, because I could get a zero cost card back. Yeah, that could be good. You'll sell damage apply vulnerable to all of them. I don't mind that one. It's not a zero cost, which is kind of what I'm hoping for. But it is an attack, so it won't prevent the the whatever it's called, the sword from going off. Choose one of three random power cards at your hand. Choose one of three random power cards. Don't know what a power card is really, but uh, I want to keep upgrading cards because I feel like if I stop upgrading cards, I'm gonna like just not be able to fight anymore. So sure I get like six health back. Like as long as I'm crushing them, I can regain health. Okay, that's not gonna do what I want. That's not gonna do what I want. Second wind. That's actually not too bad, but I think I have to go for the clashes. The clashes are so much damage. It's like 18 damage for free as long as I can keep with my strategy. I feel like that's so necessary. Well, let's learn what Malleable does. Upon receiving attack damage, gains 3 block. Gain increase as Malleable is triggered. Reset to 3 at the start of your turn. So you want big attack to this dude. Oh my god, he's doing so much damage to me. What the hell? Oh my god. Well, I gotta fucking go crazy this dude. Um, I'm gonna put this on the top, I guess. Get that out of there. I think I'm... Am I still taking damage? No, okay, I, I ended up not taking damage here. That's good. So he gets increasingly more armor. I don't like that it keeps saying a powerful negative debuff. Let's just like... I guess that this is better. Probably a math thing about this. Man, his armor really saved him there. I think I could have actually potentially killed him feeble and weakened um i don't like that well there's no point in me using that fuck it sure i might just oh wait what am i taking i'm taking a lot of damage this time you know what that's 21 damage i really don't want that Start your turn, lose one HP and draw one card. Maybe a card is... Oh, these are powers. <sighs> Whenever a card exhausts, draw one card. That won't work. Whenever you get a block, do five damage to your hand. Sure, I guess that's the way to do it. Oh, I get it for free. Dang. I actually could have saved myself a little bit of damage. I didn't realize that it made it a free card. 
Yeah, I took a huge chunk there. Wow. Guess I'm just gonna take or gain a lot of uh Exhaust all non-attack cards in your hand, deal 12 damage. That seems like what I want. Can I just keep drawing those or uh give me more of that. Give me this here. Did I not draw cards or why did I not draw cards? What did I just Did I not just use one of those draw a bunch of cards things? Draw a bunch draw a bunch of a. Uh... I thought I just used battle trance. <gasps> I cannot draw, I cannot do battle trance twice in a turn. That don't make sense now. Um, upgrade all cards in your hand for us to combat. I like that. Deal nine damage. Bring me back a clash. And I can't draw it, but I can do perfect strike. So kill it. There we go. That was messy. Deal three damage to random three enemies. Headbutt plus is probably the one I'm going to go with. Yeah. What's this do? Choose a card in your discard pile and return it to your hand. It costs zero this turn. As they often do. I'm gonna go this way because I wanna. I'm gonna have to rest up before this boss. I didn't want to. But I wanna smith here. I know if I smith here, I'm gonna have to rest up. So give me. This just increases his damage. Okay. It's seven block. Apply two weak. Four block each turn. Deal eight damage, apply two block. I think that the anger cards are the most important next for me to keep upgrading. I don't like how this looks. Because this looks like one of them is going to do a lot of damage. Um, wow, I'm actually going to have to burn this just so I can attack with this. That's interesting. Um, give me back my clash and then take that. And I hope that I'm literally ending the turn with all my energy left. That's weird. Oh no, you're fucking loading my deck up with shit. Oh, I really have to get rid of you. Give me this. Deal four damage and apply one vulnerable. Well, that's perfect. That's just perfect. I love that. And I'm gonna get that. You have so much armor, I didn't see that yet. What is that? <laughs> Block is not rooted at the start of you this turn. Okay, so it's like... Oh, he only has 20 life, though. Um, well, I mean, I'm gonna exhaust you. Might as well clash this guy up. So they think that I'm not gonna take damage now. I am okay. I'm all good. Except you're making me fragile just before you attack me, which I don't really like. Except I keep forgetting what Fragile does in this game, because I keep thinking it makes you take, or like, it reduces your armor, but it's not. It just makes you more vulnerable. Like it makes it a, get 25% less for block cards. I'm gonna upgrade them all. Cause I'm gonna attack you with my anger, cause that's just free stuff. And I guess I just attack you with this. I really don't have much armor in my hand right now, which is not what I want to see. Last year this turn, fill all your potion slots with your potions. Oh, uh, that would have been nice. I should have read what Dexterity does, which is directly below the card. Do I have a card that just says gain a bunch of block? That is a card that I would like to have. Oh, but do I want to... It's only 20 damage. I don't know, I don't really want to take 20 damage right now, you know? I'm gonna shrug it off. At least that's like, 
a bit less damage. This dude is like really fucking smacking me. You're only, you're only doing 10 there. Draw two cards, put a card from your hand on top of your draw pile. Um, what can we do? Let's get some anger plus up in here. So I want to go ahead and do that. Get rid of one of these cards. Put that bad boy up there. I'm going to intimidate you. I'm going to... Do I even need a block? I don't think I need a block. I just need to smack him and then smack him and I'm good. Yeah, there we go. Got through that one. They're getting freakier. That is a lot of damage. Deal 12 damage, put a card from your discard pile on top of your draw pile. Yeah, I like those. Those are okay. So I'm actually going to have to rest up here, I think. 30%, 20... Is that let me go into the boss fight? Yeah. That's worth it. Get me back up to full health going into the second boss. Well, you look like you're going to be tanky. I need to use a buff. I don't like it because you're buffing yourself and you already look like you're going to be hard to kill. Ah, uh, I don't want to... I'm going to do this. I'm going to go like this and this and then this and then get my clash back. I think that's what I need to do. I need my clashes. They do a lot of damage. Increase attack by two, so I feel like you're going to keep getting stronger, and I don't think that's going to do so well for me. I only get the dexterity for the one turn. So I don't know if I want to do that right away, or... I guess I'll make you vulnerable and then attack you when you're feeling sad about yourself. I think 10 damage. I guess that's why I healed up though, right? Um, you're gonna make me angry. I wanna gain a block, make you weaker. Um, I'm all good to just attack you all out now. Ah, my Nuntuck's procced. Nice. The Champ. Is that what you're called? The Champ? Hey, okay, Mr. Default Name. Um, let me go ahead and headbutt into another Flash, I guess? Wait, one sec. How many? What does this say you're doing? Negative effect on you, so I can just go crazy this turn, I think. Um, give me this. War cry. Draw two cards and put the card. In. Okay, so I have to just throw away that, I guess. Oh, but I can put a card back. So I can get rid of that for free, which is nice. Because I do. I don't really like this perfected strike. I should never pick this card up. This is a garbage card. I kind of want to pay to have it removed, honestly. Uh, attack him, attack him, attack him, attack him, get my, uh, flash back. And that does a lot more damage, so I might as well throw that at him. Okay, Mr. Uh, big debuff, what are you gonna do to me? Come at me. Ooh, damn, that was a lot of shit that you just did to me. What do you, it has to use a buff. Oh, well, at least I'll be the less frail after this. So that's kind of nice. Um, Flash. I guess I might as well use this. Didn't really think that one through very well. Sometimes you have a bad turn where you do something really stupid. That was that turn for me. He's using another buff. I like that. Um, I'm gonna headbutt you so I can hopefully get back. Whoa. Oh, that was a new card. Hmm. Morino. 
Um, let's see what cards I can pick up. More anger. I like that. What does that do? Exhaust all non-attack cards in your hand. Gain five block. I don't need block. So I'm going to save that for the next round. Yeah, I'm going to save that for the next round. That's good for like clearing out my hand of all the garbage. I'm going to be not frail anymore. This dude is fucking strong now. Oh my god. Uh, you're doing, doing how much damage now? I think this is the time to, uh, go ahead and gain that dexterity, I think. Because that's a lot of fucking damage. Oh my god, I gotta, I'm gonna get all powered up with that. Um, give me some armor. Let me fight this dude. I think I might, like, literally go back and, like... I need to draw some cards. I really need to draw some cards. I need to get some, some armor on my body right now. If that doesn't happen this turn, that's right. Sure, let's see what we get. <laughs> sure. Gain 5 block, deal 5 damage. Deal 8 damage increases this card's damage by 8 till the end of combat. Deal 8 damage. I want to do the one that gives me block. Jesus. This dude is doing a lot of damage to me right now. Oh my god. Sheesh. Oh, he's doing more damage to me. Gain some block, draw a card. Um, I guess I do have to use this, except I should use Headbutt first. Can I kill this dude? I don't think I can right now. I'm gonna need to like... I'm gonna need to gain some armor again. Gain 8 block, shrug it off, okay. I don't know why I keep thinking that brings it to my hand. I really don't know why. So I gotta do that, and do that, and then do that. At least this one's not gonna be as much damage as last turn, but damn, man. I might have to be using all my potions right now. I'm vulnerable again, and he's doing 39 damage! I'm starting to see why, he's, uh, why he does stuff. Um, I'm gonna headbutt him and get back a block card, I think. I just want to go like all for the kill right now. I can do 18 damage if I shrug it off. If I do 18, 18. I think I'm still not going to kill this turn, which means I do need health. I'm going to need to go ahead and get back. I guess I'll do uh, Battle Trance is the way to go though. I can get a bunch of good cards of Battle Trance. Oh yeah, I'll be able to get all my cards back. Yeah, okay. I'll be able to get a bunch of random cards back, which I like. Oh, a lot of anger. Give me that anger. Give me that anger. 24 damage is not something I'm able to do right now. You know, I bet you one of these, these said apply vulnerable, yep. No, that won't work. Oh, I'm just gonna take a lot of damage here, man. Still alive, but... But I think that that's gonna make it hard carrying on. Uh, let's get this anger out of here. And let's kill him. Well, that's making it pretty hard to keep going. <sighs> Definitely don't want that. Game two vulnerable. I guess.
guess that's the way to go about it. I don't think that a max HP is going to be an issue and I have 13 health left. Berserk. But I don't want to be vulnerable is the thing. I don't think I need more of that. Lose 6 HP gain. I really don't want to lose health. Like, this is like the best thing. I guess that's not awful. I think that can go into what I'm doing. Here's your turn. You can no longer see enemy intents. That seems bad. Obtain a curse and three relics. Curse cards. Picking up, obtain one potion. Gain 50 gold. Raise your max XP by five. Obtain one card. Upgrade one random card. That just seems good. That's all perks. You know what? Fuck it. Sure. Uh, not the best card, but uh. That seems horrible. Apply 12 damage, apply 2 weak. That seems horrible. And that seems horrible. So I'm gonna have to skip the card. Nickel oil, draw 5 cards, random other cost your cards in your hand. That's horrible. Also, man, no luck on that one. Apparently, I have to choose a card here. Nice. I'm gonna have to go with Body Slam because at least that's one cost. Hello there, you're probably wondering, Dan, why is the video just about done and you haven't even died and you haven't completed the game yet? Well, you see, the reason is because this recording went on way longer than I was intending. So I split up into multiple parts and if you got this far, you know that I have completed section two. So if you want to see me take on the last part of this game, go and uh, check it out at the end of the video. Check out part three, uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button, make sure you hit the like and uh, leave a comment if you want. And uh, I will see you over in part three. Peace.